Good afternoon, guys. This is Ross with Southern Smoke Barbecue. Um, tonight we're going to do flank steak, uh, basically carne asada here in Texas, what we call it. It's just a flank steak with the marinated it and uh, Sprite, Allegro, marinade, and olive oil with salt and pepper. So we're going to start now by lighting the charcoal. So I'm going to cook it on the Weber kettle grill tonight over charcoal. Simply light that. We're going to let that go until the charcoals turn gray, and then we'll add our meat, which I have had marinating um, overnight. Come on, guys. All right, guys. So I'm going to do a little demonstration about how I uh, prepare it. I'm getting ready for the grill here, so. I've been marinating this in a Ziploc bag and the Allegro, the Sprite, and the olive oil with salt and pepper overnight. Alright guys, so I'm just going to do a little demonstration of about how I prepare the uh, flank steak for carne asada tacos. Uh, so I've been marinating this all night um, in Allegro. Just Sprite and olive oil. Um, a lot of times I'll do it differently uh, with some, you know, cilantro and uh, lime, but this recipe is just very simple. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys how I do it, and we're just going to throw this on the uh, Weber kettle grill. Um, so let's take a look here. It's been marinating approximately 24 hours. Uh, so we'll just take it out, get it prepared. Ideally, you want to get it to room temperature, um, but in Texas, guys, this is what we call carne asada. We've got our pico de gallo ready uh, and tortillas, fresh tortillas, so we're going to grill this up on the kettle grill, and um, that's uh, pretty much what it's going to look like. It's just a flank steak. Uh, they're actually getting pretty expensive, but very easy to do. Just marinate it, and we'll grill it here in a little bit. So I just wanted to show you guys a little demonstration on how we do that and how simple it is um, to grill. It's also delicious, um, it's fun, and it's a good hobby, you know, to uh, feed your family some good quality food. Um, so that's what this channel is for. And uh, here in a sec, I'll put it on the grill and show you guys. All right, guys, so this is kind of where the magic happens. We're gonna put the charcoal on. The charcoal is turned gray. I have my flame steak right here. And I'm gonna dump the charcoals into my Weber kettle grill. Get nice and hot, get that grate hot. Rubber flank steak right here. It's been marinating. It's going to be really good. It cooks really fast. It's a thin uh, cut of meat, so it's going to cook really fast. And I'll kind of show you guys um, how I do it here. Bring the camera over ever so slightly. Kind of demonstrate what we got going on here you can see that you see the charcoals in there okay, that's a better better view for you guys here right there kind of see that and um, we'll leave that probably three to four minutes aside you can kind of flip and turn as you as you watch it uh, crisp up and um, cook so I'll show you guys how that goes okay and it's still continuing to cook I'm gonna show you guys
little flip like so. We'll just keep flipping it back and forth until she's done. Okay, and as it cooks, it'll start looking like that, kind of browning around on the tops there. Just keep it going. And you don't want to cook it too much. Uh, it's a thin cut of meat, so you want it a little pink in the middle. And it just takes a few minutes on each side, guys, on a real hot grill. All right, guys. <clears throat> so we have our flank steak here. Um, just kind of pay attention to the striations in the meat. It's going this way, so it's going vertically. Um, you can see the uh, the meat there, how the uh, the stripes go this way. So we want to cut it against the grain, kind of diagonal. Um, so we'll go ahead and do that. Get you a sharp knife and a fork. That's all you need. Just kind of slice at an angle here to whatever uh, slice uh, size you want. Um, we're going to do them pretty thin because we're doing tacos. Uh, but I can just show you what it looks like. It's steaming hot. It's a little pink in the middle. Let's go into that bite. So, so good, guys. Tender. When you let it marinate like that. Just an amazing, amazing. For a carne asada. So try it out, guys. Let me know what you think. Really, really delicious. Thank you for tuning in, and have a great evening.